Hello guys, my staff have arrived. This is called sea foam. It's the first time I'm using it because uh, my kitchen area has some sink. The the floor tiles is sinking a bit. So I was thinking. I saw saw this this type of foam. It called like polyurethane. Polyurethane foam. Then you can uh, inject into the floor. Do some holes first. Then inject into the floor. It will expand. As this uh, this will expand, forty two to forty five liters volume in volume. This is uh, seven hundred fifty ml, and you expand to forty two. That forty two. There is is about fifty times. You expand fifty times. So I have ordered ten. It's for professional user, for professional user. I ordered ten plus the professional gun. This one. Maybe next time I still can use it in other areas. Because they have other products. This is the first time I'm using, so I'm documenting it. So I will have to drill, drill it. Uh, it's about ten mm. The front part of this is ten mm. This gun, ten mm, and you taper it to even a larger size, which I don't think I need to insert that long. Then uh, there's only this this gun. There's only one adjustment. This is a behind one adjustment, and this is the activate. Mm, somehow, so I show you guys the what happened to my kitchen. Okay, this is the whole view of my kitchen. Okay, there's a counter and a table. The the whole area here, actually from the counter there, and to the chair here, it starts sinking down. I show you how much, how much it's been sinking down. Uh, as you can see, here this gap, I've silicon a bit. The gap is quite small, as you can see. Then it's getting big, bigger and bigger this side. See more and more pronounced. My finger could enter, but I've I silicon it to prevent insects and all that stuff. So this is about nearly one cm. Nearly one cm. I think it's one cm. So then I've put a metal bar to show the worst. This is this this side, this side, which can show the tiles is already having a difference, having a difference. And this is the worst case. Then I put this metal bar to show the the worst case scenario. You can see the large gap. The large gap there. This whole area is sinking. This whole area where the counterpart and the t table. This whole area is sinking down. Uh, in the case, this is not very serious. One cm is not. It's only considered start of moderate, which I think so lah. Then uh, the counter. This has also. Start to give the, the gap. You see the wire nearly, nearly can go in. The wire nearly can go in. See the, the, the gap. I'm not. Uh, I'm not hundred percent sure. It will. It will leave this this floor up. I'm not hundred percent sure. Cause this area, we don't know what. I don't know what's under it, and it's the first time doing it. So and a little bit outside, little bit outside, which and I'm not so concerned. Sir. Then, as long as it stops sinking, stops sinking, I'm happy. I'm not really concerned about it, it raising up, but I, I think it can raise up. It can raise up. So, I've placed this, this spirit level here. I don't know you can you guys can see. You know. Let me zoom in closer. It's about, it's, it's, it's slightly more than half a degree. You can see it? Slightly more than half a degree on, on the counter. Original is uh, nearly centered. It, it moves move about half a, uh, more than a quarter degree. 
So that this is my concern. I'm I'm documenting this because uh, it's only the, like one step. I have to drill all the all the holes and spray it simultaneously. And this this thing, according to it, this C foam, according to it, it will expand and dry within four hours. You guys can pause and and read two to four hours uh, as this is going to be pumped into underground I think it takes at least four hours to do it to be hardened and expand let's see how these few days I'm uh, planning where to drill the holes first this now is a investigation on where to drill it as the best later I'll come back to you guys